n is given 3 power n plus 2 power n is equal to 35. So we have to find out the value of n here. How we can find out the value of n? Let's see solution. Three power n plus two power n is equal to thirty-five. This is question. So we can write this three power n power one value same plus two power n power one is equal to thirty-five. Now three power n. So power one. This power one we can write. 3 by 3 then uh, 3 by 3 that is 1 plus 2 power n power 1 is again 3 by 3 is equal to 35 now so we can write 3 power n by 3 we are now using a cube form so 3 power n by 3 3 power n by 3 power 3 plus 2 power n by 3 n by 3 power 3 is equal to 35 now uh, let's consider here 3 power n by 3 3 power n by 3 is equal to x and 2 power n by 3 is equal to y this is equation number 1 and this is equation number 2 now 3 power n by 3 is x so it will become x cube x cube plus 2 power n by 3 2 power n by 3 that is y so y cube x cube plus y cube is equal to 35 now this is the formula of a cube plus b cube uh, this is the form of so we can write here formula a cube plus b cube is equal to a plus b a plus b times a square minus a b plus b square this is the formula of a cube plus b cube so using this formula we will get here x cube plus y cube is equal to we can write x plus y times x square minus x y plus y square is equal to 35 right now x plus y times x square minus x y plus y square is equal to 35 so uh, definitely here x plus y is less than x square minus x y plus y square x plus y is less than x square minus x y plus y square so we have to find out the factor of 35 uh, that is x plus y first factor that is uh, you can see here 35 factor first we are taking factor of 35 so uh, 1 times 35 1 times 35 in this case 1 is less than 35 so x plus y is less than x square minus x y plus y square and in second uh, factor second condition we can say uh, 5 7 are 35 so 5 is less than 7 right so, uh, so we are using this is case 1 and this now we are taking case 1 so according to case 1 x plus y x plus y times x square minus x y plus y square is equal to 1 times 35 1 times 35 right so here x plus y we got here two equation that is first one x plus y equal to 1 and next one is x square minus x y plus y square uh, is equal to 35 and uh, uh, most uh, important condition that is x plus y is less than x square minus x y plus y square that is 35 so here first equation that is x plus y is equal to 1 and next one is x square minus x y plus y square is equal to 35 so you can consider this equation that is x square minus x y plus y square is equal to 35 this is equation 3 because already we taken two equation that is 1 and 2 so this is 3 now x plus y is equal to 1 so if we are taking square both side then we will get x square plus y square plus 2 x y is equal to 1 now this is equation 4 
this is equation 3 and this is equation 4. Now we have to subtract equation 4 from equation 3. Then we will get subtract equation 4 from 3. So equation 3 is x square minus xy plus y square is equal to 35. This is equation 3. We have to subtract equation 4. So equation 4 is x square plus 2xy plus y square is equal to 1. This is equation uh, 4. Now we have to subtract this one. x square minus x square it will cancel. Minus 2xy minus xy. So minus 3xy plus y square minus y square cancel is equal to 35 minus 1 that is 34. So uh, minus 3xy is equal to 34. Divide both sides by 3. So minus 3xy divided by 3 is equal to 34 divided by 3. So 3 is cancelled from 3. So we can say uh, minus xy is equal to 34 divided by 3 or xy is equal to 34 minus 34 divided by 3. But you can see this is fraction uh, form. So this will reject it here. Now case 2, we are taking case 2. Now case 2 is x plus y times x square minus xy plus y square is equal to 5, 7, 35. And you can see x plus y that is 5 and x square minus x y plus y square is uh, uh, equal to 7. So x plus y is less than x minus y. Now first equation we will get here x plus y is equal to 5. And next one is x square minus x y plus y square is equal to 7. Right. So uh, this is equation number 5. And here x plus y is equal to 5. So we can uh, write this x plus y whole square is equal to 5 square. So x square plus y square plus 2xy is equal to 25. This is equation number 6. Now we have to subtract equation uh, 5 from 6. So subtract equation. 5 from 6 then we will get equation 6 is x square plus y square plus 2xy is equal to 25 and equation 5 is x square minus xy plus y square so x square plus y square minus xy is equal to 7 we have to subtract this one so x square minus x square it will cancel plus y square minus y square cancel uh, plus 2xy and minus minus plus so plus 2xy plus xy it will become 3xy minus minus so it will become plus here so 3xy is equal to 25 minus 7 18 therefore xy is equal to 18 divided by 3 therefore xy is equal to 3, 6, 18. Value of xy is 6. So this is equation number 7. Now we, got, now we got value of xy is equal to 6. But according to case 2, x plus y is equal to 5. According to case 2, you can mention here according to case 2. This is equation x plus y is equal to 5. Therefore, we can say y is equal to 5 minus x. This is equation number 8. Now substitute value of uh, equation 8 in equation 7. Then we will get uh, x times y. y is 5 minus x is equal to 6. Value of y. x times 5 minus x is equal to 6. Now 5x minus x square is equal to 6. So we can write this if we are uh, uh, changing sign here. So x square minus 5x 
plus 6 is equal to 0, right? So, x square minus 5x, this 5x we can write minus 3 minus 2, that is 5 and uh, 3 to the 6. So, minus 3x minus 2x, that is minus 5x and 3 to the 6. So, plus 6 is equal to 0. Now, taking x common here, so x minus 3 and here also x minus 3, so minus 2 is outside. So, minus 2x minus minus plus 2, 3 is a 6 is equal to 0. Now, x minus 3 times x minus 2 is equal to 0. So, we have uh, here two equation that is x minus 3 equal to 0 and x minus 2 is equal to 0. Therefore, we can say x is equal to 3 and here x is equal to 2. We got a value of x is uh, x uh, two value of x that is x equal to 3 and x is equal to 2. If x is equal to 3 then value of y we, we have to find out. So uh, according to case, uh, case 2 that is x plus y is equal to 5. This is a given equation. So here if value of x is 3, 3 plus y is equal to 5 therefore y is equal to 5 minus 3 y is equal to 5 minus 3 that is 2 if value of x is 3 then value of y is 2 if value of x is 2 at that condition x plus y is equal to 5 so value of x is 2 so 2 plus y is equal to 5 therefore y is equal to 5 minus 2 therefore y is equal to 5 minus 2 3 so we can say if value of x or you can say x1 y1 if is equal to value of x1 is 2 if x1 is 2 then y1 is 3 and if x2 y2 if x2 is 3 then y2 is 2 now let's verify is this correct or not so x1 y1 2 3 and x2 y2 is 3 2 uh, we are not verifying here first we have to find out the value of n because question is uh, we have to find out the value of n so uh, for find, uh, finding the value of n we will already consider that x is equal to 3 power n by 3 and y is equal to 2 power n by 3 we already considered this uh, you can check from equation 1 and 2 from equation 1 and 2 so if x is equal to 2 if x is equal to 2 here so 2 is equal to you can mention here if x is equal to 2 so 2 is equal to 3 power n by 3 and if y is equal to if y is equal to 3 so here 3 is equal to 2 power n by 3 now 2 equal to 3 power n by 3 and 3 equal to 2 power n by 3. So here we uh, we can uh, we cannot uh, means conclude this. So from this and this uh, you can conclude that uh, there is no any integer solution, right? So this will reject it. So this will reject it. Now if uh, we are uh, taking second value, that is if x2 y2 is equal to 3 and 2. So, x is equal to 3 power n by 3 and y is equal to 2 power n by 3. So, x is 3. So, 3 is equal to 3 power n by 3. And here, y is 2. So, 2 is equal to 2 power n by 3. Right? Now, 3 is equal to 3 power 1 by 3. So, 3 power 1 we can uh, write this and 2 power 1 we can write this. So, 3 power 1 is equal to 3 power n by 3. We know one formula that is a power m if a power m is equal to a power n. So, if base is same, then power will also be same. So, m is equal to n. So, according to this, we can say here 1 is equal to n by 3. Therefore, n is equal to 3. And same way here 2 power 1 is equal to 2 power n by 3. So, uh, same formula here, if a power m is equal to a power n, uh, power, uh, base is same, so power will be same, so m is equal to n. So, using uh, that same, we can write this m, uh, sorry, 1 is equal to 2 power n by 3, right? So, therefore, 
uh, we can say n uh, n is equal to so here base is same so we can say n power is 1 is equal to n by 3 therefore n is equal to 3 so value of n equal to 3 we got in both condition now let's verify is this correct or not so let's verify say power n plus 2 power n is equal to 35 and we have to verify for n is equal to 3 this is the value of n so 3 power n n is 3 plus 2 power n n is 3 question mark 35 3 power 3 3 power 3 that is 27 plus 2 power 3 that is 8 question mark 35 27 plus 8 plus 7 5 and 2 plus 1 3 35 is equal to 35 so here lhs is equal to rhs so value of n is equal to 3 this is correct solution in this equation thank you